Hi there, today we've got our first Mac video for you. So today I'm going to be showing you how to use most Windows webcams with your Mac computer. So like me, you've just you've got a Mac. So I've got I've got an uh, Apple Mac iBook here, uh, but uh, hasn't got a built-in webcam. Okay, as you can see at the top there, no built-in webcam. So I have to buy a Mac webcam if I want to use it. Not anymore. I've just found a way to use a Windows webcam. Good. So let's show you how you're going to do that. It's very good. Skype picks it up. I haven't tried it with MSN yet, but I suspect it will. You can record read videos to it to your actual Mac. Uh, which it from inside the software that you're going to use, it's, it works fine. The only thing that I will say is I haven't yet figured out how to put sound in it as well because my my webcam doesn't have a built-in microphone and my Mac does, but for some reason it's not recording that sound. So I've still got to try to figure that out. I'll assure you, once I have figured that out, I will do another video and show you how to do sound with this software and I will put a link to that video in the description over there okay the description so let's show you how we're going to do it what you're going to do you've got your Mac you're going to go into your web browser now I'm using Kamina because I find it is faster than Safari okay so we're in Google in Google you're going to type M-A-C-C-A-M or one word, Mac cam. Okay. I haven't yet done screen share. Figured out. I haven't yet installed screen share into this Mac, so I uh, can't show you very well. That's why I'm just going to hold it for you. So, and you're going to do the Google search. And the first one there is going to be Mac cam call on USB webcam support for Mac OS X. You're going to click on that. It's going to come up with a page like this, Mac Cam. You're going to click on the little button just here, right, that says download. Okay, and it will come up with a list of your versions and CVS bundles, current files, and different things like that. You're going to want to download current version, and that's 0.9.2. Okay, so you're going to click it. And then it's going to open your this page like this, and it's going to open your web browser's download box, and it's downloaded. As you can see at the top there, I have already got that, so I am going to cancel that download and exit the web browser. Okay, and then I'm just going to quit my web browser to make my computer a bit faster. Okay, so once it's downloaded. It will come up with a little box. One moment. Right, once it's downloaded, it will come up with a box as if you are installing any software to a Mac. Now that box will look something like this. I'll just show you from the original download. Oh, sorry, that's not the original download. I can't show you at the minute, but now it does come up with. I'll tell you what. Now I'll just uh, I'll just get the file out of my can show you, shall I? The original file. There we go. Right. So it'll come up with a box like. Oh, that's still not the original file. Anyhow, it'll come up with a box which you'll need to read through. It'll ask you to drag your application over to the application folder. So you need to do that. Then once you've done that, there is then another one a little bit further down there, which is a support file, which you'll need to drag into the folder on the other side of that window, which it will actually show you and talk you through there. Once it's installed, you're going to open it up, and you're going to have some software come up like this, Mac Cam. Okay? So now, if we just turn back to me, that is all of the software that you're going to need. Now I would now I have got another Mac webcam. Now I mean a Windows webcam. Here. 
you can. This one here. But I can't show you, but this one does keep, does, um, it's uh, not very good. It's not very good uh, on Windows or Mac, so it, it keeps failing to work on Windows and just about, and it works about five seconds on Mac, but my other, my all Windows red cams that aren't, that are working correctly, will work. This one's not, so, um, I would show you with my creative webcam, but I am actually using that to record this video, so I can't. So I will just show you this. Plug it in. Okay. It's plugged in. Okay. So if we look on my Mac, it, the window has got bigger, and at the bottom there, I don't know if you can see, it says connected to, and then the name of the webcam. Just up here. Okay. There. Okay. So then if I just click on the little play icon in the corner here, it will show me what is on that webcam. So I can show you my, me holding my other webcam. But, as I say, this webcam that I'm using does have a problem, so it has just come up with USB communication problem at the bottom there, but you will not get that when you're using a webcam that actually works, which I'm using a webcam that doesn't. So, you need to use a webcam that's going to work for you. Okay? Now if you just look on this software, I will just show you, you've got the ability at the top here to take a uh, to save the current image, to take a snapshot. Next one is to record a live video to a, a quick time movie phone. And then you've got the camera video settings over here, the brightness, contract, saturation, here, gamma, sharpness, grain, shutter, compress and all of that stuff. Okay? And then if you, you've got the icon here to hide that bar along the top. Okay? So it will work with Skype. I have had it working with Skype. Uh, so that is how you use Windows webcams on a Mac. Uh, so I will, once I've figured out the sound, I'll post another video. Bye. Oh, don't forget. Wait, comment, subscribe, and visit the website. Link will be in the description.